Right. I've got the umbrella because I think I'm expecting showers today. Um, the toilets were not open. I was quite surprised. Nearly everywhere else I've been, they've been open. <sighs> On my walks, I've been everywhere and I've not found anywhere shut but here. <sighs> not to worry, we... It's all on the video. It'll all be over YouTube. <clears throat> Bolsington don't open their toilet facilities. <sighs> yeah, I've done this walk the other way most of the time. I've come down. Um, I did do a brief visit last year where I I did do a brief visit last year <clears throat> where I went up here and, and I, I went, I came down the coombe. I'd been up and down it so I do know what it's like. <sighs> but I've not been up it with the weight like I've got on my back now. So this will be interesting folks. Uh, there's a few little undulating hills leading up to the coombe. You might find I'm not videoing a great deal. I might stop and do a small video part of the way up when I stop for a breather. Right, over and out for a minute. Right, the toilets weren't open at uh, Bosington. A bit of a surprise, really. But anyway. <sighs> Steady climb up. <sighs> People coming. Over and out a minute. A lovely, happy family. Everyone's taking a risk. Old and young alike. I shall have a break at the foot of Hurlstone Coombe. I should take the correct stuff completely off. Have a drink of water. At the top of Hurlstone Coombe is Sheila's bench. Someone was waiting for me to come along when they put that there. It'll be my third time sitting on it today if I can. So here we go, folks. I still haven't decided whether to do the rugged route, which I want to do. I do want to do it. My pack will get lighter as I drink the water, but I can't drink all the water right away. It's got to be spread out. Uh, there's nowhere to, nowhere to fill up at all. I didn't even fill the big bottle right up today. Um, I did it three quarters just to take a little bit of the weight. I had a glass of water before I come out, a glass of orange juice, two cups, three cups of tea. I made sure I was quite hydrated before I start the walk. I mean, at the moment, my rucksack isn't too bad, but you load it up, and what happens is the stuff starts to sink down your back. So, though you put all the heavy stuff on the top, like they suggest, around your shoulders. The lighter stuff starts to get flattened and the stuff starts to <sighs> gradually go down your back towards your lumbar region. So I'll have to refresh it in a minute. I didn't want to keep the plastic cover over the top either, the canopy, because it, I need it if it suddenly buckets down. Of course I need it on there. 
I didn't bring a walking stick. I wanted to, but quite often I'm handling the cameras, like now. It'd be a bit jumpy because I'm having to hold it with one hand. And I've got the umbrella instead of a walking stick. I mean, the umbrella's got two functions. It's good for keeping the rain off. It's good for keeping extreme sun off. But I haven't done that so far. I've got a hat, which is in my bag. I'm not putting that on unless it's a bright blue sky and heavy sun. Because it makes my head hot. We'll start doing the climbing in a minute. This bit's this was the easy bit. This is the easy bit. I didn't even record that bit. Forgot to turn the recorder on. So I forgot to put record on. I just said that um, the memory card went and the battery. They both went at the same time. So basically, I'll have to do another recording at the top. I'm not going to record going uphill. I've done it in the past with a light pack on. I'm not recording today. I'm not going up it. I'll record when I get to the top. Right then, folks. Looks like rain is coming. Just uh, seeing some people. I'm giving them a bit of a start to get up that hill. Because um, I'm going to struggle up it. And I won't be talking when I'm doing it. But if we look over to Foreland Point now. Look at that black cloud and look at the mist over there. That could be rain and it could be coming this way. What a shame to a lovely walking week I've had so far. But I think the rain is coming. I might have to put my waterproofs on. What I do, I'm going to get them out ready.